Hey folks, we're here at the uh, Punta Gorda um, Farmer's Market. And this is Lewis and Lewis's mother here, uh, Freedom, Freedom Girl 80. Morning. Good morning. Morning, Dr. Sean. Hey, how you doing? Yes. Hey. How are you? Nice I'm not to doing meet too you. bad. Nice uh, to meet I, you. Good to meet you. Good to meet you. You as well, sir. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I saw him. They, they, they followed me. They were circling the. Uh, they were circling. They were. I followed. Me. I came in on the other side over there and I had to go around the block. Right. But they were following me. They were circling the uh, farmers market like oh, sharks. Lord. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, well, I got a nice t shirt. Oh, yeah, yeah. Like Punta Gorda. Yeah, how you like my. Uh, Fucking my First Amendment, yeah. Yeah, except it's not a U, it's a move. Greek, fourth letter of the Greek alphabet. Oh, yeah, man. There's violating the First Amendment. Yeah, yeah. Basically, if you have anything on your shirt that has, like, America, fuck yeah, because it has first words, you'll get a $100 fine. Yep, next time it's a $200 fine. Thank you. Do we have a spot, safe spot we can set a drink down? Set a that's just right there. I, I okay. just over there by the pole. Yeah. Okay. Hey guys. It won't have the cups in you. Violate your right to the first amendment. Littering. It's a violation of Cohen v. California by giving you a hundred dollar fine for having curse words on your shirt. Imagine that. Oh. Are you uh, live or are you going to go live? Oh, no, I'm going to edit later. <laughs> okay, okay. Only if it gets really bad, I'll go live. Yeah, it might. So. Right. Hello, oh, everybody. That's Dr. Sean Barry. Go subscribe to him on YouTube. How you doing? Yeah. Sean yeah, Lewis, what's your, what's your uh, channel? Your, live free or die cop watch. Live free or die cop watch. Yep. Uh, two words. Live free and... Uh, all one all one thing. All, all, one, all one? Okay. Yep. Okay. And you're, you're Freedom Girl 80? Freedom loving girl lady. Freedom, freedom loving girl. Freedom girl lady. I got Yeah, books. yeah, yeah. Okay. But make sure y'all go subscribe to Dr. Sean Barry. The link yeah. to his channel will be down in the description below. Yeah, and always keep an eye too. Every time uh, you know uh, Lewis here comes, uh, cop watch comes down here to, to uh, you know do any kind of thing. Always keep an eye on his lives because yeah. he's there's a lot, a lot, of, lot of nasty going on here in this town. Absolutely. A lot of nasty. like my speech I want to know why they investigated him illegally it's a uh, special crimes unit is what it is and, uh, is that? They, they put a special crimes unit on, on, on us all of us oh yeah yeah so uh, they're investigating like we're, we're gangsters well according or... to the Florida State statute for an ordinance yeah they can't I know, I know. Once well they can't like, well they can't do any of the stuff they're doing now no but like, I have all documents yeah. I have yeah, well, there's a yeah. trial that will violate your rights to the First Amendment. They'll give you $100 if you have something on your shirt they don't like. And they'll, put, America, fuck yeah. and
Yeah, see if you can identify what cop this is down here. I don't, oh, I don't know most you. of them by name. I, I know the, I know the major ones by name, but I don't know most of them by name. Right. The ones I know by name is everyone knows Pam Davis. I, I know Lipker, Jimenez, Miller. Yeah. Uh, woke, woke. Well, I don't know how to say yeah, it. Yeah. Well, I, I just say woke. I don't know. <laughs> I like the woke movement. <laughs> yeah, he's the same one that uh, threatened to shoot the armed fisherman. Yeah. Car. Yeah, that's why it's kind of good. Come down here, get a good look. Twenty seven City of Panda Gorda vehicle. Is that a police vehicle over there too? Across the street. Quite likely he is. Well, a guy in undercover? Yeah, it looks like it. Mm, possibly. Well, the tent, you gotta look at how dark the tent is, too. True, that is the point. Yeah, they're the only ones that can really get away with, with the uh, well, dark for tent. Me, not for me. This is my sign here in case uh have some move that's not a U, that's a move. Twelve let me see. Twelve, twelve letter. You see oh, this? that's not a U. That that that's, looks like Greek. It is, it's a, a moo, it's a, a twelfth letter of the Greek alphabet. Same thing you use for micro whenever they uh, use math, math. That's a great loophole because that's not even the same language then at that no, point. No, no, it's 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 a, a telus. I see it whenever you use a Greek letter. In a, in a, a word, it's right. traditional to to italicize it. So I italicized it as well. Now it's officially a Greek letter. Yeah, yeah. I do not know who this guy is. I don't think I've ever seen yeah. him. I don't. Hey, you know he's uh. Florida audit's coming? Uh, he said he was, so, you know, I don't, I don't know. He might be a little late. I, uh, I told him before 10, 10, 30, 11, you know. Right. So he, may, he might, might be some more people here. Sounds like a plan. Yep. So I'm going to try to figure out who called, so I'll end up doing some public records. Uh-huh. But, but my thing is, we've been listening to the radio before you got here, and we didn't hear nothing about no more coming to the farmer's market, no nothing. Yeah, yeah, they, they're, they're monitoring everything. They have um, somebody circling right now. You'll probably see them. Yeah, I saw the truck circling around. Yeah, well, it was a, a, a patrol vehicle circling, too. Hmm. I was on the other side. It came in on the other side, and it uh, led, me, led me over there. So I had to come back on this side here, you know. And they followed me all the way around. Gotcha. Yeah, I hope some more people show up. That'd be nice. Yeah. But even at that, three, three people will be pretty fun too. Yeah, who are these bozos down here with the suits on? I have no idea. I haven't had the chance to look at, look at those guys yet. Yeah. I think they're promoting something. Yeah, Jerry popped his head out here yet. Yeah, I saw him. He was talking to one of his vendors. Uh -huh. So it's going to probably be one of those. I'm surprised he hasn't called yet. How you doing? Yeah, those guys are probably promoting something. Maybe like some lawyer or something like that. 
Honorable Police Department will violate your rights to the First Amendment. They'll give you a hundred dollar that, two hundred dollar fine, just for free speech on your shirt, on your clothes, hat, sign, flag. Protest, the- protest sign. F Trump flag, F Biden flag, get you a hundred dollar fine, up to a five thousand dollar fine. They'll put a lien against your house like a dead local man here. And yet, there's already a rule Free in speech. California that prohibits them from doing that type of stuff. down this way here. This is the old courthouse. I, we were in here a couple of times. Yeah, well, she just tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, depending on how on how riled up Jerry gets, it will depend on the, whether you're gonna have police. Yeah, have a police behave respond. Hmm. So then, you want to rile Jerry up then? Uh, I don't want to rile him up, but the damn old communist cut needs to be wound up one time. Pardon my French. Yeah, well, you're fine. Hey, it's free speech. Like it's them, it's not. Yeah, well, to them, to them, it's an annoyance. We're just we're just terrorists to be observed by special uh, crimes units investigating. Pretty much, and for four days. My investigation was four days. Oh yeah, it's ongoing. It's not, it's not just. Wait, wait, go ahead. Yeah, it's wind. It's like a sail. <laughs> Nobody was stationary. Yeah. Yeah, I stood out here on this corner pretty much, and I, I a few months back, back in May. And I had a uh, old man want to jump out of the car on me. Oh shit! Yeah, stop right in the middle of the road and jump me off, jump out on me. Fuck. For the word fuck. <laughs> We're gonna go around the back. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably that might be a good idea. And kind of hold our signs here on the road so people can see it. Yeah, as we're going that way. Yeah, I might stand here on the corner for a bit. If you want to you go around the back, or you feel safe going around the back, or you need to. Um, well, since you're here, I kind of want to. Yeah, yeah. Stay yeah. as a pair so that they can't try yeah. to pick us off. Yeah, yeah. Well, sometimes that kind of helps. You know, you're still within camera distance, but you're far enough apart. That's a good point. Sometimes that helps. They they think you're you're by yourself, but it's real easy to you know come up on something like that. A lot of times that works pretty well. We go inside of a uh, government building and they see you by yourself, then you're an easier prey. They jump on you. Just as soon as they jump on you, your buddy comes walking in and two other people come walking in the cameras. After they're like, oh, right. oh, oh, you know. And then they don't know where just yet. Yeah. I'm actually going to go on this side. Yeah. Get some of these cars. Yeah. Back yeah, I figure I'd just hold a sign out here a little bit and let people see it. Are we gonna have a little more a little more foot traffic here on the a little more vehicle traffic on this thing here. Number yeah. two? Yeah, there was a uh, patrol vehicle going around. I do I think he was showing support. <laughs> People who got bikes normally like have code and shit.
Yeah, it's nice that you got one-way traffic here too because you can you gotta get everybody going one way. And you, then you can switch over here to this side, you know. I did this, uh, like I said, for a while uh, on the, I think it was like the 2nd of uh, May. Yeah, you get a lot, a lot of support, you get a lot of fingers, you know. Right. I mean, I get a lot of my interactions yeah. over there by the farmer's market because you yeah, got people yeah. calling, coming away. Well, I figure so long as we're down this way here, we could probably hit a few people, but yeah, that's good there. My goal right now is to let Jerry know about free speech. Exactly. Apparently, he thinks his little buddies, his little goons he's got over there can, can uh, stifle free speech. So, Jerry needs to be addressed, and those goons need to be addressed. They're, they're, they're just goons to what they are. Oh, yeah. I call them the thin blue line gang. Yeah. The yeah. gang in America. Yeah. Are you playing your annoying instrument again? My what? Annoying instrument. I mean, I guess to them this is an instrument, but we literally have my mom actually. She yeah, brought, I know, I know, I know. She brought all them papers. Yep. Definitions, everything. So see yeah, all those little, all those little things they try to do to, to stifle our free speech, chill our free speech, stop it. You know, right. stand in the way of it, gaslight it. Everything that they do is add up. It's like a marble in a jar. You know, you put one more marble in a jar, eventually you're going to have a full jar. Yep. Whenever it comes down to the courts, we have all this documented. Oh yeah. Yeah, so it's gonna come back on them. Yeah, we got we document everything. Yeah, yeah. Honagora police kills free speech. Hundred dollar fine for words they don't like. Up to five thousand dollar fine. Yep, and a lien on your house. Yep. See, technically, they can charge me for this because it's an excretorial function, you know. For the work for that. Yeah, they could, technically. What the fuck? That's why I was going to put shit on there, but, you know, perhaps a little, little bit more mild. Right. So I got the mild sign and I got the other side, you know. Right. Yeah, so, flip-flopping it. Yeah. Yeah. The other side? You like that side? I like that side too. <laughs> All right. Honor Board of Police hates free speech. Hundred dollar fine. Up to a five thousand dollar fine. Get rid of the ordinance, unconstitutional. Call and, him be California. And they even put a lien against one man's house here. He waved to me. So oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go say hi. Yeah. <laughs> Did he engage? Well, he waved to me. He yeah. asked me well, how that's, my a, day that's was. an engagement. So. No, nah. that's what I keep telling him. No sense in it. It's gonna come whether I'm nervous or not. That's what keeps don't, don't block the way here. I mean, everybody just counts as your charge. Yeah, I say leave the garage door because all the pads are in Hey, how you doing? Do you like my shirt? Everybody else seems to around here. Well, I can't say that I like it, but do you agree with it? He can't. He can't say. You can, I know you can't say. I know you can't yeah. say. But you got a. That's an Italian last name. You're originally from up north. Kentucky. That's not that north. And this sign here is that's true. That's true. That's, yeah. That is that. It's a very true statement geographically speaking. So can I ask you why this ordinance is being selectively enforced? Have you noticed it's being selectively enforced? Can I show you? Sure. All right. Awesome. Do me a favor there, buddy. Yeah, you don't want to get hit by the cars that are not allowed to. Nobody. Nobody. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll be yeah. on the way when they come this way. I got the line. Thanks. I want to give you. So we're trying. Is that a period? Uh, that's a moo. Uh, it's a Greek letter, twelfth letter of the Greek alphabet. <laughs> Interesting. I could have put a delta in there or, or uh, uh, phi, but I put a, a moo in there. 
lowercase. It's pretty slick. Yeah. 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 Like you're violating that. Well, even up close, some people, you know, don't if they if they don't uh, don't know the Greek alphabet, you know, they would just say, well, it looks like some of the officers were saying whenever people had a, the flag taped off, you know, like his flag. Uh, there was a gentleman here who was fined because I can see through your tape. Here? Yeah. Hmm. I can see through your tape, so therefore so I'm here, picketing you. Let me show you. I'm doing you. Oh, you can do that. You can do the question. Let's go. You might as well just not even wait for the question. Just be like, all right, this is me. All right. So we have this work here. So right? So we also have. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I'm willing to share. Yeah, that's why it's out here for. It's a publication. Yep. Yeah, freedom of press. <laughs> freedom to assemble. Freedom, freedom of speech. Whenever you put it on a sign, it's a it's pamphleteering. Yep. We have another square. Yep. They don't care about the state constitution or the U.S. Constitution. They don't care about the constitution. They don't care about the case law. State, state law, state, the state constitution. No, they do not. They even been caught on camera saying that they know it's unconstitutional to DJ tax. Yeah, yeah, I've had them, I've caught them on camera saying it's unconstitutional. But they said they had to enforce it because it's their job. According to their own, they're not supposed to, though. Yeah. Well, the Jews were Jews were marched into the furnace because somebody was just doing their job, just following orders. Imagine that. Yep. Yeah, even in the military. Yeah, even in the military, the military tells you you're not able to you you can refuse unjust orders. Exactly. So. Free speech, First Amendment. Hunter Gordon is trying to kill it. How you doing? Punnett Gordon is trying to kill free speech. They're trying to find people for free speech. Technically, this could get me a, a $250 fine.
Houston versus Hill. Hunter Gordon is trying to kill free speech. They put a man in jail for it for 30 days. I love Jesus too. God bless. He deserves all the praise. Uh, no, they put me in jail. They put Andrew Sheets in jail for 30 days. I don't know if you know him or not. Andrew Sheets, he does. He used to do a lot of protesting here on this corner. People didn't like what he said. So they put him in jail for 30 days. They sentenced him to serving the peace. He didn't know about his uh, probation, the way they set it up. Because his lawyer, his lawyer turned coach and her trainer on him. And gave, gave him 30, gave him uh, uh, two months probation. That yeah. guy that comes out all the time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Isn't it him right there? No, no, that's, he's taking over for him while while he's out because he uh, had to do 30 days. He's on probation now. He can't do this. One of the uh, things of probation, he's not allowed to protest. In Punta Gorda, you, they took his guns away for a misdemeanor. Yeah. Are they trying to silence him? Yeah, trying to silence him. That's what's going on. Wow, this is like against Donald State. Yeah, yeah. I, I've seen two buddies of mine get themselves jumped by the cops in the, in the police lobby. We are trying to film and get public records. They shut the window down so you couldn't get public records. And we were complaining, trying to get them on the phone to get public records. They came out, and it's, uh, one officer called Lipker, he's, he's, he's got right in the head. He came out and shoved the disabled veteran into a wall, grabbed him by the by arm. He had his arm put together back in the we're military. Gonna we're going to sue him. Oh, he's, he's in the process of suing him now. He's got to fight the criminal charges first because they charged him with a, a battery on a police officer. He pulled his arm away because the arm the cop grabbed him by the arm and tried to drag him out the door. This guy's like 300 pounds. Yeah, yeah. And, and he had that arm that the cop grabbed is one the military put together back together for him. Yeah. Anyway, he jerked his arm out of there, and Lipker went all nutty and said, you assaulted me, so he charged him with assault on a police officer. Yeah, because he said that you exercised his constitutional rights. Yeah, yeah, but, but when somebody here jumps in... If he was here in drag, in front of children, that's, that's good. Well, it, I, it's whatever they want. It's, it's, it's nothing vulgar. See, the, the law says what's vulgar. It's already written down. It's been written down since, like, the 30s or 40s what's vulgar. Uh, Miller was a... Miller test is what's called the judges use. If it's something that's sexual, you know, and, and this is not sexual right here. It's just a word that's used for everything. You know, it's a, they use it. It's in the, it's even in the dictionary. It says it's uh, used for everything. You know, you see people using this word all the time here, you know. Sexual meaning. Uh, so uh, you should sue the fuck out of Puerto Rico and win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, get, you got a lawyer already? Uh, no, I can't find one here. I'm looking. I'm, I'm real close. I've, I've got like two lawyers. I'm, I'm sending Are you, sending you trying to help him? Uh, I might, yeah, I might have just protested myself. Give me information because I can put it to the rest of the uh, Republicans. Yeah, yeah. And spread it around the news. And I'm, yeah. a, I'm a web developer. Okay, yeah, thank you. Yeah. So I need, I need his name and everything. Uh, Andrew Sheets. He goes by uh, uh, Charlotte County Cop Watch is what he, what his channel is. He got like five channels. They keep shadow banning Charlotte his channel. Charlotte County Cop Watch. Yeah, yeah. Charlotte County Cop Watch. And he's in jail now. No, no, he's not in jail now. He's on probation. He did 30 days in jail, and now he's uh, trying was to. He was here last week. Uh, no, he was here last week. The other guy, he, no, he's been for about the last two months or so, or three months. He hasn't been here. He's been here in this place. So his name is Charlotte County Cop Watch. Wow. Yeah. Right. Yeah, he's been doing this for about uh, almost 10 years now. Uh, I don't know if you know Andrew Sheets, not Andrew Sheets, but uh, Ian McGuire. I don't know if you know him. Andrew Sheets. Uh, let me see if I can get, get, get the word out. And help them out. So they yeah. got a Republican uh, thing going on. Yeah, in yeah. Fairgrounds. Yeah. I was yeah, planning on know. going over there and filming. I'm a Republican myself, you know, so. so yeah. And I, I'm in support. I'm in all the support of you. You know. call yourself Christian and say you're a Democrat. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But a lot of black people, 95% of black people. Oh, oh look, look what's going on with abortion. You know, you know, you know yeah, by, 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 80, by 80% of the people who are border are black people. So that 80% of people are bordered are black people. Black Americans. Mark, Mark, that's that's but black that's Americans. We're people. dumb. Ninety-five percent of support Democrats. Well, well, it's it's, 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 brain, it's brainwashing. Is what it is. It's brainwashing. No, they, they, years they, and years. You can't, can't, can't support a party. That's what it says. Yeah, yeah. You can't support a party. Yeah, I'm okay to kill babies at nine months in the womb. Yeah, I know. And you call yeah, any, a yeah, any baby, any baby. You know, even even uh, you know, just new. That's a life. That's somebody. That's somebody's child. That's somebody's husband. Somebody's wife. You know, that's a, a person. 
That's a person who who should yeah. be worshiping worshiping God, you know. Yeah. All right, brother. All right, you have a good blessed day. Hunter Gordon is trying to kill free speech. They're finding people up to uh, $5,000, putting liens against their house, and putting them on, in jail for disturbing the peace for free speech. Yeah, thank you. Y'all have a blessed day. This is public this sidewalk. This is public sidewalk. 30 bucks. Huh? It's public sidewalk. <laughs> I know I'm standing on it. Oh, yeah, yeah. So yeah. did you pay? Huh? Because you stand there, did 30 bucks. Yeah. You paid 30 bucks to stand there? No one walked around. Uh, How would you pay to stand still? Yeah, yeah, we know we have no wheel. wheel. We're just out here trying to get a word out there, you know, about. A uh, what? A word? Yeah. Some of the words they use, we don't like for our Yeah, but they've been around. Oh, you, 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 free speech. you were around back in the 60s as I was. Uh, you heard them. Uh, I can go on YouTube. All right.
How you doing? Have you been to the courthouse or anything? Uh, no, not not yet. Yeah. I walked, walked in front of it over there. Haven't been been there yet. I've, no, I've been, I mean, I've been, like I, not today and other days. Yeah, yeah, really, I, yeah. I've been, yeah. I've been, I've been in the uh, courthouse. I've been, I've been trespassed from many places too. You know. Really? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, they trespass laws. They have to ask you to leave, and then you have to refuse to leave. Yeah, yeah, but they, you but, know, they can't just yeah. trespass you just without giving you a chance to leave. I know, you know but they, I mean? they they usually hand you a trespass warning. You know, and, and you don't uh, have to sign it though. I know you don't have to, but they they have under. Uh, Jesuits versus state here in Florida. You know, you, okay. you, you're not, you don't have to ID for a civil infraction. You know, if you didn't break a law on a 901 .151, you don't have to ID. But they forced me to ID under penalty of uh, arrest. Wow. So yeah, wow. that's a Fourth Amendment violation, clear on its face there. You got you an attorney to pick it up? Uh, well, I'm looking at some of them right now. I'm waiting. We're kind of waiting on the decision. There are two gentlemen who are up in the state right now. They've got a case that's like a year ahead of us. Uh, we're still hung in kangaroo court here in, in the Pope court, you know, here in here. Yeah, Sterling County, you know, it's a good old boys club around here. Yeah, they yeah. Don't, yeah. And, the, and the 20th Circuit's been protecting them like China's been protecting Kim Jong-il. They've been kind of keeping them up a little pet here, you know, and not letting it get higher. They've been keeping it down, like, you know, keeping the uh, people from getting up into a higher court. But they made it up in the state, so, uh, yeah, we're waiting, we're waiting on a decision. The Impressive. judge, the yeah. judge, are expecting him to decide favorably on, on free speech and against the city code for free speech. Is that a Andrew Sheets? Yeah, Andrew yeah, Sheets okay. and, and, and Macy, I think. The, both of them have them together. They combine their cases together because they, they, they said they were so similar, they just it would make it easier in a court. Okay. Yeah, I love watching those audit videos, man. You know, it's the yeah. entitlement of some people. I catch myself, like, sometimes, be like, yeah. chesting up to the TV. I'm like, don't Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I, I, I've caught myself... Especially when a cop does it, you know, they just yeah, go better. Yeah. They, their ego, just the ego gets in the yeah. way, you know. Yeah. And I think to myself, yeah, damn it, you know, you need to lose your job. Yeah, yeah, no, I support yeah. you guys, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we got to say, if you don't, you don't exercise the rights, stuff. To yeah, lose yeah, it, right? and that's what's happening right now. You know, we're getting too many people sitting back and letting it happen, you know. There's so many people. You are see, just like, you can see it happening. You can see it with the government right now. What's coming down? There's and so that's many only lap dogs, you know. Yeah, and lap dogs for clout, you know. Yeah, and they just yeah. like, yeah, you can. You can shit all over me as long as you give me a little piece of the pie. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly what they're doing. But that's, that's what they're doing. Well, see, that's what's banana republic right there. That's what they're doing to uh, uh, their future generations. You know, the, the countries. Yeah. Whenever you do that, it, you don't come back from it. You know, you, right. you, if you do, okay. it's going to be a bloody civil war yeah. to try to come back to something it's like that. Slow paced takeover. Bull in the frogs, they, Yeah. They take you right slowly, just inch by inch by inch. Next yeah. thing you know, you know, then it's and, the, and where it starts is always fucking bootlegging. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. It's that's where it, where it is. starts. And like, so, yeah, yeah. So there's some, some of them are good out there. I'd say about, you know, I don't know, yeah. whatever. But uh -huh. uh, support you guys. Oh yeah. Well, thank you. All right. That hey. we're crapping on it. Yeah, they, yeah, they are. Thank you. We don't want to. Done. I do. You know how powerful the, the union is? 
you know how powerful the union is? You can get with the union reps. I can't tell them, hey, they're they're That's doing right. this. So many veterans, so many veterans in the department. I know there's so many veterans in here like that they, who who took the oath and multiple times, you know, foreign and domestic, you know, you, you uphold your oath. So, yeah. So y'all not standing by yourself. Y'all have y'all have all the other people blue, blue behind you. You could you could just appeal to them. You said you liked it. What would you say? You don't really like it. What can you do about it? What are you going to do? Did I ask you for a citation? I'm asking you why I have it. But I thought it was complaint driven. But then it reads something about 17 year olds. So which is it? Oh, yeah, I know. I'm asking yeah. you why you have it. Yeah, there were complaints made on uh, that uh, abortion march I had with but several hundred people. And what, what did they tell you whenever you Oh, uh, yeah. When I go try to make a complaint on July the 2nd, I was told there's more of you. Oh, no, no, no. I try to test the waters to see if they're going to be biased. And I said, I like to make a complaint. I see curse words. And there's pictures in the, those papers over there. Such as, for example, one side said, my neck, my back, my pussy will fight back. Take you women's rights to small dick energy. Yeah. So I made a complaint, right? They had bullhorns and everything. So I tried to make a complaint to test the waters. They said, yeah. we can't do nothing. I said, well, why not? It's your ordinance. They, they go, well, they're protesting. I go, well, well, what about what I'm protesting? What's the difference between me and what I'm protesting and when they're protesting? Yeah. They said, there's one of you, and there's many of them. Yeah, First Amendment, uh, Fourth Amendment, and Fourteenth Amendment violations there. Yep. Yeah. There's case law. Yeah, Fourteenth Amendment, definitely on, on, on its face. Yep. Got biased policing, yeah. selective enforcement, and that's actually a felony. There's yeah. actually U.S. Code, the deprivation yeah. of rights. It's actually political well, discrimination. That's yeah, so under uh, uh, discrimination eight, eight, 18 U.S.C. Yep. Now, these guys right here have more support behind them than they know. I mean, maybe if they, you know, stand well, yeah, with the they people, could, they, they, could have, get well, with, they have my support if they would stand with the people. Well, they, 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 they'd they have my, I, God bless good cops. We need them. God bless good cops. We need them. I you mean, know, this you country, this country right here would fall slap apart without good cops. But the problem is, is we have don't two. Don't make it the militarized. Yeah. That's my thing. Don't make them militarized yeah. or surveillance. Yeah, I like the end of group of uniforms they, went, they used to have, you know. The black uniforms denote uh, more uh, fascism to mm. me. It's, it's just a connotation to me, you know. Right. But I like the end of Griffith uniforms. I like the white shirts, you know, for supervisors they have in, uh, you know, some of the cities. But, yeah. My thing is, do we need cops? Sure. Yeah. Because of nonviolent crimes, people can't use need, the Second we Amendment. Need, we need, our social contract says, we, you know, we, they, how they dictates how authority we give them, how they should behave towards yes, uh, upholding the law. Use the Second Amendment their, oath, their, oath, their oath reaffirms that social contract we made with them. Exactly. And the power and the power we gave them. You can't right. decide with that. So, I can't use the Second Amendment on someone who's. Um, okay, that is just, put, um, I can't use the second amendment on someone who's right. taking yeah. something out of my car. You know? Yeah, well, uh, it depends if you go over and try to get your stuff back and then, and then they menace you. Or, or, oh, well, or, then, yeah, 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 point, yeah, of yeah, yeah, of course you're going to go over there and try to get your stuff back, you know. Right, if someone was to snatch this out of my hand, I can't use the second amendment. So then at that point, yeah, we need the cops so for those things like that. Yeah, but if they but grab they don't it, need to be militarized. but if they grab it out of your hand, that's battery, and, and, and then you're, you're if, if you're reasonable fear that they might try to batter you again that's then, then, then well well the, i wouldn't use it i would say you could use a gun but you could use pepper spray two yes. ounces two ounces is legal here yes yeah you can use pepper spray yeah which means you can't say what goes on my clothes but none of this is about what reasonable fear that somebody's going to do harm to you exactly yeah pepper spray it's harm to you and uh uh if you use this, your second amendment you have to stand your ground with a, a weapon then it then it's then it's uh, more than uh Harm, it says de death or, or, or serious bodily harm. Yes, that would definitely yeah. use a fire. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, you just said he does. Then you think he does. Then you've heard he does. Have you seen his YouTube channel? Okay, so then we can't confirm that he has one. But you're under the. Did you let him know? That he is. Did you let him know about the surveillance that this man was under? Yes. Oh, yeah. It was oh, yeah. yeah. Illegal. Yeah. Illegal. Um, it was investigation. him. Oh. It was him. Yeah. 162.21. There was no complaint prior to the investigation starting, which is required. We hear about the FBI. 
Well, we you're, under the statute, you need to have a complaint no, 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 of a no, violation no, no, no. of the ordinance. No, to issue the citation for your investigation. Well, for special crimes units like that, investigations you have to have, yes. you know, it's, it's the same case. thing. It's the same thing as the uh, FBI, CIA spying on people here in in in, in, the, in the United States. They're allowed to spy on people overseas. But that they're not allowed to spy on people here in the U.S. Exactly. Same thing. Same thing. Unless there's a reason for articulable suspicion of a crime, yes. of, a foot. And me protesting is not a crime. No, Even no, a no. Of civil no. They know. They know what you do don't, is not a crime. Exactly. But what it is, these guys are just foot soldiers for you know city. Yep. That and corrupt, then you that corrupt mayor. To arrest me. Yeah, what's that corrupt mayor's name? Um, here? Yeah, yeah. I don't even know her name. Yeah, I know one time she got on to a couple of the board members about trying to go against her. Yep, I saw uh, that. Yeah, yeah, and she they wanted to fire those board members. See, they wanted to fire the, oh, sorry. Everything. Yeah, they wanted to fire those board members and uh, start with a, a probably a more lenient, more, more compliant, you know, compliant people who are willing to follow the order is easier. What's the difference from us being in a police Are you under, are you doing an investigation right now? Yes, you are. I have the tab report that shows you are. Absolutely, it sure does. Y'all should be being paid by, by Jerry, you know, uh, on a uh, special detail. Security here? He's a hire. He should be paying yeah. you, not me. Yeah, Jerry, yeah, Jerry should be paying. Well, Punta Gorda, it is you. If, if Punta Gorda's paying, then you, well, are, you are paying. No, 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 I don't live in Punta Gorda. Well, but still, when you buy you buy gas, candy bar, or you buy gas. Oh, well, anything you buy in Punta Gorda, then at that point, yes. Yeah, yeah. County, then, yes, then I technically am paying. So, or if you buy anything here. Like, if you buy, let's say, a candy bar from the store, you pay a tax. So then, yes, at that point, you do. Yeah, I just stopped in here and made a pit stop over here at Circle K and, so and bought a few things. I mean, I pay taxes here. Yeah. Um, City. So you are sweating like a... Actually, it's helping out. Like that. I yeah. I wish Jerry would, would, would no, learn. You know, Jerry needs to hire private security if he doesn't like yeah. what I do. Well, I wish he would learn that the First Amendment is nothing. He just tolerate it. And if he tolerated it and didn't say anything, you would just stand over there quietly, like, you know, like a before, you know. Yeah, and I would just talk to people yeah. that come up to yeah. me. Yeah. But if it wasn't for the cops and Jerry, well, I would be screaming. I don't know who Jerry got with or who he, who he had uh, some sort of uh, special. Uh, session with in the city to hire, have have the city pay for his security, you know. Right, and they got the volunteers here too. Yeah, yeah. Now I'm not sure. I mean, they probably have a program they have to pay for. I'm not saying volunteers make money. Yeah. But they probably have the program they have to pay for. Yeah, yeah. I want your son. I want your daughter. Well, he's paying for the venue, so you know this is a private event, and he should hire uh, private security. Yeah. For private event. Oh. Local business. There's one. Some of those that look like houses. Those are actually businesses. Um, I believe City Hall is actually their doors are open, so I think there's some happening there. Yeah. I, public building, honestly. You might ask the officers, so they might know we're closer place. Y'all know. Y'all know a restroom here. Cursors on your shirt. They hate free speech. They'll give you a hundred dollar fine for it. Yeah. Y'all know a restroom. These kids can go to the bathroom at close by. They need a bathroom. Yeah. Twins. They're beautiful. I just noticed they were twins. Um, I don't know if the bank's open. Oh, I tried. Jerry. Yeah, this it's Jerry, the man who hates Did free speech. No? no, it was locked. Oh, this is public, sir. Um, public, public. This is public, right there. Yep. That becomes your thing. This yep. right here is public. This is a public easement. So, you're, so you pay for this Jerry, grass? Jerry, Jerry. Jerry, you paid for the grass? Have you ever seen the Constitution before, Jerry? Have you ever heard of it? I'll bring a copy for you. Yeah. Free speech. Did you know if you wouldn't be a bitch, people be over there in the corner minding their own business, just getting people on their way in and out? Yeah. Learn what public property is as well. Damn. Sorry, children. Last Sorry about that. I don't think you paid for this I, I, I right wouldn't, here. I wasn't thinking of the children while I was sitting here and said that. Yeah. I drink. Trying to blow the opposite way so I don't get hit with uh, assault by smoke. Yeah. <laughs> Jerry, read a copy of the Constitution. So, the point I'm trying to get at is 
Learn it, live it, and love it. It ain't going nowhere. Oh, and tell our vendors to stop assaulting people and threatening to kill them. Learn, learn the Constitution, live the Constitution, and love the Constitution. And it ain't going nowhere, Jerry. Yep, it ain't going nowhere. Get they, your panties out of the wad. Yeah, they keep trying to bury it under a lot of other uh, case law, but it's not going anywhere. Exactly. I saw him, yep. Yeah. 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 Planet Gordon's trying to kill the First Amendment. Finding people $100 for the first fine, up to $5,000 for free speech.
Hunter Gorder is trying to kill the First Amendment. $100 fine for the first offense and up to $5,000 for free speech. Hey folks, Planet Gorda is trying to kill free speech. It's a hundred dollar fine for a, for a word, up to five thousand dollar fine. Wow, a hundred dollar fine for for a word. I heard, I heard. Yeah, up to five thousand dollars. They put a lien on a man's house for it already. Wow. Oh, Y'all have a blessed day. You too. Get out of yeah, well, I, I come here. I don't live here. I come here because of the uh, violations. They're trying to uh, kill the free speech here in Punta Gorda. Uh, it's a hundred dollar fine. They're trying to kill. They're trying to kill free speech in Punta Gorda. It's a hundred dollar fine for any word they don't like, up to a five thousand dollar fine for free for free it's speech. Biden word. Yeah, yeah, but the uh, thing is, we're out here protesting it, trying to stop them from doing it. You know. Yeah. So I know folks don't like these words, but but you know okay. if, if they're going to fine you for them, you know, then then you know we need to get out here and use them. So that's what, what we're what at is here. it from the city council? City, it's, it's a code enforcement. Oh. City code enforcement. Oh, you have a blessed day. All right, folks. Punta Gorda is trying to kill the First Amendment. $5,000 fine.
Good morning. It's a $100 fine for free speech here in Punta Gorda, and they'll charge you up to $5,000 fine.
Hi folks, Pony Gordon is trying to kill the First Amendment. Finding folks $100 for the first offense, up to $5,000, and putting a lien on against local residents' homes for free speech. How you doing? Uh, Punta Gorda is trying to kill First Amendment here. They're trying to make fine free speech. $100 fine for the first fine and up to $5,000 for free speech, just for a word. Oh, y'all have a blessed day. Punic Gorda is trying to kill the First Amendment, try to kill free speech. Hundred dollar fine for free speech for a word. Up to five thousand dollars.
God bless our First Amendment. Patty Gorda's trying to kill it. Hunter Gorda is trying to kill free speech, $100 fine for, for words, up to a $5,000 fine. God bless what's left of our Constitution. The First Amendment, Ponte is trying to kill it. Yeah, Lipker, Lipker's done going off the deep end. What's that? Lipker's done going off the deep end. Lipker's kind of lost his mind. No, 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 no. It was a de-escalation. Hold on. Let's define the word de-escalation is to bring down. We were never up. So you can't de-escalate something that was never but you can't. But you can't escalate a situation. We're just having a good, good old conversation. God bless the police. And God bless the, uh, their oath they took. May they hold to it. Protect and serve. This one won't get water. Look at those boots. You gotta drink water. You gotta hydrate. Tell them, Mama. Gotta hydrate. As a mama had telling you to go drink water. Hunter Gorder is trying to find us out of a First Amendment.
Our First Amendment goes, all the rest of them go. <laughs> Sorry about that. For free speech. It's called free speech. Back in the 60s, they knew what free speech was. I was there, you were there. We share that in common. <laughs> Make love, not war. Gordon is trying to kill free speech. They're finding people, finding people a hundred dollars for a word. If you make contact with him, that's battery. That right there was a menace. You just menaced him, sir. That was a menace thing right there. You swung your fist at him. Officers. I just observed a man menace somebody there and, and put them like the right, like they were there, they were in danger of safety. He swung at him while ago. He swung with the attention of the just. He's standing there. I'm standing. He charged at me. Hey. 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 Hey, sir. 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 It's on your camera and it's on my camera. He came to me. Are you going to press? And he lunged at me. Oh, sir, and he lunged at me all on are camera. You, are you going to press charges? Go ahead. Are you going to press he charges? He didn't put his hands on me. He did yeah, not he, put he, his he, hands he, on me. He did menace you though. He swung at you like he, he was trying to put well, you Well, he did go like that. that he was, did with his hand. He did it with his hand. Because he doesn't like, he doesn't like my son. I'm just standing here. It's all yeah. on camera. That happens. Right <laughs> that happens because I've had it happen so many he, times. He gets to walk away. So he's just going to talk to her. What does she have to do with it? He what lunged. did you do? The guy that was up here in his face lunged at him. Lunged at him. Yeah, put somebody in fear by actually swinging your hand at their face. You know. Yeah, and have him the phone. Yeah. All, all for for example, I saw I saw his yep. hand go and at your got face. It on yeah, I got I do it. too. Yep. So what crime are you alleging? I'm not alleging crime. I'm just saying what the fuck just happened because you came to You here. tell me, was that a crime? That was a menace. Somebody, it's somebody it's menacing. Happened. Okay, so for example, if I take my is a Florida is a Florida statute. Huh? It is a Florida statute. The menace. statute? No. Menace. I don't know what the statute number is, but it's a, I can I can look it up. Do we have Google? Yeah, we can. The minute the minute somebody menace somebody is and and that, that and he swung he swung at it he, and lunged swing at it. Yeah, he he went like this. Is that a crime? What were you doing at the time? Stand in here. Was, he, Stand here. Verbal, first Verbal does not constitute you throwing hands with me. 
Or yeah. get a lunge neck. Sure, you're right. Yep. So okay, the so then what? So anyway, why is that even a point? Anyway, anyway doing this. Did he say come doing, at me? Doing this at somebody. Did you say come at me? I didn't say come at me. I, said, I called him a pussy. And I said, you're in a stand your ground state. You want to lunge on me in a stand your ground state, pussy? That's what I said. That's not First inciting. That's not inciting. He didn't ask him to come to him. Right. I said it's a stand your ground state, pussy. The minute somebody, Jerry. But Jerry. So now he just gets to walk away? But if it was me, you would arrest me, right? Or if it was yeah, Andrew okay. Sheets, you'd arrest Andrew Sheets. Jerry, Sheets. Jerry, do you know that man? So we got Jerry, all John's. Jerry, does he work for you? Jerry. So this is what happens did, at Jerry's Farmer's Market did you, speed. Jerry, did you get a, a, a heckler's veto going? He's got a heckler's veto going? Yeah. Heckler's veto. Yeah, I think I think Jerry knows the guy. I'm not certain. Yeah. And a good investigation would, would come about from, you know, we've got two investigators here. He walked away. He gets to walk scot free. If we had two investigators here, they could investigate whether Jerry knew this guy. I'm sorry. We're doing it. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. You guys are quitting yelling, so I have to okay, do this okay. Thank okay. you, Mark. Thank you. Mark. But he's, Jerry's not the guy. We just get, we just get. Stop yelling. I'm sorry. Jerry's not the, the guy. He's not here. They're asking him who he is. Jerry's standing here? Jerry's not the guy. Talking for okay. two seconds. It's free speech. Right? Don't standing. tell me to stop talking. He was standing here. Be that's why I'm talking to him. He's called a witness. It's okay, then that's fine. If he's a witness, that's fine. Okay, thank you very much. Go ahead. Then that's fine. Okay. Thinking everybody in the world. We get it. Go ahead. We're trying get to the do info. it. Well, he's stop. walking yeah. away now. We're, he's not there. He's not going far. Yeah, I think he's going to outrun me, and I wouldn't even be over here if you weren't yelling. No, okay. it's not him. Go, go, let, go, go let them talk to him. Go ahead. Go yeah. yeah. figure out yeah, who he is. Yeah, we get a look excited. We're sorry about it. There he is. Thank you. Go figure out who he is. And speech, it does not constitute physical and you can and you can defender. and you can oh, okay and, uh, all right so what are you alleging what crime are you alleging occurred i just made it up known assault. that he lunged at me assault assault define assault okay. Okay. Where's assault? assault tell me exactly what happened in the court. my words i'm standing here they won't well, jerry walks what up. what were you doing i'm standing yeah, here descriptive as you can Y'all have it on body. Okay. Y'all have it on body cam as well. You may not have the entire thing on body cam, but yeah, y'all got a lot of it. Yeah. Okay, standing right here okay. with my sign, promoting free speech. That which was on the sign. Jerry. Let them do their. Let them do their thing. Damn it. Comes up to me. Look, well, they're actually right there. No, she's recording. Right, and I'm like, yes, publicity. Yeah, put me on. I was about to say my channel name. What door? And so my channel. No, I'm not touching the back door at all. And I don't. Know. Yeah, just, like, he will use your about, words against you. All right, no, not you. Ma, uh, Ma, come here. Just look I, don't this wanna, way. I don't want him saying that I lunged at him. Sorry. So the sign's about right here. All right, that works. Physical um, example goes like this and then walks away. And then I said, you want to lunge at me in a stand your ground state pussy? Then he comes back. And then like all buffed up, like, you know, macho, macho man style. Like and I saw, I saw him do this too. I was, I'm sorry about this. Yeah, he's throwing Go for it. He was doing this right here, and then he went. Oh, nope, that's him. And he, he stopped. You know, he but it was quick. It was a quick thing. So that was that was putting somebody in fear of being. He could have made contact. And phones are glass these days. Yeah, that could cause a very. But anyway, if I, it, I I know. And you, that's from a medical standpoint. I know you. So. Y'all you, don't. Y'all don't. Unless somebody breaks the law, y'all don't have any more rights than we do. But if I were to do that to you, I'd be in handcuffs and I'd be down there for menacing the police. That is officer. very true. Yeah. We can't be very selective on this yeah. now. See, y'all don't have any more rights. If no laws being broken, y'all y'all on the street you don't have any more rights than the rest of us do, you know. But if somebody would do that to you, and you know you know what you would do, he would help. 
Nine. I'm also not yeah. screaming at somebody. Anymore. Where, it where, matter. where, where? That one is that matter? Yeah. So what? I, yeah. can, I can yell all day long. We're, Stop we're, we're engaged in protest. I'm not talking about the yelling alone. I'm talking about what's being yelled. Well, so we're, we're, we're engaged. We're engaged in. Okay. But not a crime. So he did not commit a crime by yelling. Yeah, what was that case? As long as it's not fighting anymore. I don't know. Be what was that Westboro okay. Baptist Church uh, uh, protest? I didn't say any fighting words, so what does it matter when I say if they're not fighting words? Yeah. What's fighting words? Is that... Like they're de they're, they're, they're that? defined... Oh, no, I actually have that definition. They're, they're actually yeah. defined... Words, defined yeah. as, uh, let's say in, uh, the case. That's not yeah. fighting words. If I say, I'm going to fuck you up, those are fighting words. Yeah. It's got to be like as a threat. Yeah. It has to be directed at a person. Don't worry, I got it all written down. Pledge kitchen. Imagine fucking that. Continuing education opportunities every day. I love oh, yeah, to see yeah, yeah. the dude's detained. The dude's not even freaking detained. That's fine. That's fine. You, you probably won't. Flip the script. I'd be detained. Absolutely. What yep. kind of shit? And, and, and the other officer would jump on you like, like a sack of potatoes. Like right. Right. Yeah. And and it, this it, is all recorded. She's got to Don't delete that. You got it on camera too. Don't delete it. She started filming after the fact. Well, no, she was already like this. We before have, we he have to see that. You got it, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got it. Yeah. Don't leave that footage. I could tell you, short, shorty, um, shorty. Yeah, he got him, it. He, he got, got it. it. Yeah. He was facing yeah. this yeah, way. He got it. I was probably blocking True Fan. Yeah. And, and at I first, had, I thought the guy was I had recording. my back. I had my back to it. At first, I thought he was recording, so I go, hi. And then I see it's music. But I did turn Spotify. around, and then I did see him in his face, and then the phone in his face. Yeah. That I must yeah, have I, I, I saw, that he was recording. I saw he was doing this right here. So I said, hi. I saw he was doing this right here, and then he. You know, at your face. That that puts you in fear. Hey, if I did it with a fist, or if I did it with this phone, or if I did it with a, a, stick, a stick or anything else like that, to make you in fear of your safety. Correct. Right. Technically, and nobody's it's, it's menacing, see, menacing, and, menacing, and, and, and it's over also here an assault. Me, we need the police. I said I never said we don't need the if police. They if they don't make contact, it's if it's not not a battery. But if they do make contact, then it becomes battery. Or if they take anything off of you, Assa but yeah. that's assault though. Yeah, it, contact it is assault. Battery. Yeah, yeah, yep. that yeah. is considered it's assault. It's assault, but it's also yep. it's also it, it's also well, menacing. The other one. Mine's it's also, juice. Go get my it's juice. also menacing. Yeah, it's menacing. Yeah. Technically, I could have thrown it because he's heckling. It's heckler's veto, right? There. Yeah. Uh, if Jerry put him up to it, if Jerry put him up to it, it, it was heckler's veto. Well, you can see he's got. A, you saw Jerry was right a, out here. A radio. Saw, he's hanging out with Jerry. Yeah. He knows Jerry. Yeah, yeah. So a good investigation for two investigators. Yeah, let's an investigation on them now. Yeah. Instead of me for free speech, a lady turned around and said to me, we need the police. I never said we didn't need the police. Oh, yeah. But Absolutely they not. need to be doing the right thing. That's, that's the difference. That's our social contract. Okay, that is the difference. Yep. They need Absolutely. to be doing the right thing. One, I do purchase things here, so yes, I do pay for a portion of their salary. Me. And if they get any grants from the state or from CCSO, yeah. Charlotte County, then you're paying them. Then I am paying. Yeah, yes. So I don't care if I am a resident here or not. It's irrelevant. It yeah, depends it, on where it, the money is going. Well, it's their if, statute. If, they're, they're, if they're, a quarter of my penny. Comes yeah. to this city. Well, there's also case law involved that too. So you don't you don't have to be a resident then, of any town. Every town, if you're an American, every town is your town. Correct, exactly. Yeah. So they have a statute, they have a case law on that. Who is calling me? But we have a little issue. Someone basically just assaulted me, so now we're figuring what's going to happen. You guys are turning back on. Why were they off? Yeah. Uh, no, it was one of Jerry's goons. Let me handle this with the cops real quick. Do you have an ID with you so I can get your information? All right, I see. What? He wants your ID. To a file, to I never said the words I'm making a complaint. I'm saying what happened. Well, you, you have to do one or the other. What, you get, what's going to be what comes of the complaint? I would, if you want to press charges, I would uh, identify and do the whole process, swear it in and everything. That's part of the process.
Fred Gordo is trying to kill free Whatever speech. Finding people a hundred dollars for a word. Up to five thousand dollars and gets a five thousand dollars to put a lien on your house. For free speech. Our first okay. amendment goes, all the rest of them gonna go right along with it. Tony Gordon is trying to kill free speech. Hundred dollar fine. So I did give up my ID for the purpose of all making the swearing swearing out a complaint. Yeah, you have to. Yes, it's actually the, the yeah. Yeah, Tony Gordo is trying to kill free speech. Yep. I mean, I haven't even gone under oath yet, so. Hey, listen. Well, once you. I've seen plenty of unethical crap, okay? So once you swear to it, then you're under oath. Huh? Once you swear to it, you're under oath. Absolutely. Once my hand goes up, yep. Hunter Gordo is trying to kill free speech. A one hundred dollar fine for a word. Up to five thousand dollars, then they put a lien on your house. I'm sorry. Hunter Gordo is trying to kill free speech. A hundred dollar fine. What? No. Look at this man. Look at. Wait, wait. You want to see something funny? You weigh less than. Oh, less? Yeah, I thought you said more. But look at this. Look at this. You're pinky. They think sheets came back to you. They don't know if I or if I should have to get them. Hey, Hunter Gordo's trying to kill free speech. Um, for a portion of it, sure. Because I had my back towards some of it, but I did spin around and I did see the camera and the man in his face. Then you can only say what you saw. So I can only see what I saw, right? Oh, you got me. Are you going to be a witness? Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Okay. Thank you, officer. Yep. Oh, look at you. It's so nice in there. Don't worry, I can get that. I can redact just as much as you guys can. Oh, it, oh, oh I I, it just pulls out all the same time. Mm -hmm. That's why I have my wallet. I'm just trying to make sure that don't have my weight either. Jesus. You never ask people their way for that. You should know that, right? You got a mom and a wife. I mean, look, the way I have mine is. So that what okay. happens? You need to get a wall or something similar like this to where you can flip flop and hold on to the wall. You want to know the reason why we're standing here? Okay, she don't even talk yet. Guys, they have my weight on. Thank you so much. Here you go. Just don't get mad if I get it wrong. As he walks away. What did he hey, put? Do you want to be a witness to this, sir? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Can I see your identification, please? Oh, okay. I want to hear. I'm going to get mad. I know I'm going to get mad <laughs> since he made that comment. So, yeah, no, I don't think. Think about it. Think about it from, from another perspective. Obviously, not Trump. <laughs> Just a different You guys need to say anything. Is that just coming? Yep. Yeah, correct. But if it's on camera, you got to be called to the to work. Or it's failure to act. I don't see why everybody is saying that. It's all on camera. Hello. I'm not talking about video. I'm talking about the audio. You're muted, right? So you can say a lot of things. and you say things outside of the case when the cameras aren't. I mean, there's a lot of times you can say Correct. But during... During it, like listen, when you guys leave, turn your stuff off, and you guys, what are you doing? What are you guys doing? Fucking bathroom. You test your weight as well. Uh, no, but, no. Wait, what do you weigh roughly? Uh, about uh, 290. Such, I think those things need to be not muted. I forgot the gift from these guys. Also, do you have a number we can reach you at? Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's uh, 352 857 5121. Uh, 352-857-5121. Uh, 
five one two one. Right. No, 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 no. I'm saying you don't actually knew. I got to start from the beginning. It's my own number. I don't have to remember. You're talking this whole time. You've been talking about status. I don't need any control. No, I'm sorry. 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 I'm
You know, Punta Gorda is trying to kill the First Amendment. The First Amendment goes, all the rest of them will follow. Right, Y'all folks have a blessed day. You're putting your good word on that that, that occurred. Can you watch your wording? Because I think you're misleading me to do something that I shouldn't do. Constitution, Article 1, Section 4, Freedom of Speech, Freedom of Press. Damn straight. Yep. And you got Section 5, Freedom to Assemble. Right. So I wonder how far this is going to go. Well, I think it's got about as far as it's going to go. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Probably. Yep. Thank God for good cops. Yes. For good cops, yep. yes. Hold the bad ones accountable. Yep. Give, praise the good ones, hold the bad accountable. God bless them. Are we allowed to do what, sir? Can we cross the small cars coming? Or Florida doesn't have a, uh, Florida doesn't have a, uh, a, a jaywalking statue. So if there's no cars coming, you can, you can cross. One good thing about Florida, you might have some local ordinances that you get involved, but Florida doesn't have a statute for it. You can find a garbage can. Hey, don't. Panagora is trying to kill free speech by finding people $100 for a bad word they don't like. Any, oh, really? word, any word they don't like. 
that can fine you up to five thousand dollars and one man had a lien put on his house for free speech here in Punta Gorda. He's going to sue the city and he's going to win millions of taxpayers dollars because of these guys over here enforcing feelings. Okay. You know if you want to give me a sworn statement or not. Yeah, the others did, so I will as well. Okay. So. Walk down here, please. And I, I've raised okay. the wow. Hold these for a second yes. here. As as Remember, that's not the bad word. Move. That's got the move in it. Yeah, it's got the move. Oh, you have a blessed day, sir. Okay, just step up uh, okay. Here, yep. That way we can make sure the audio gets picked up on this. Okay. For some reason we have to do them on the phones even though we got our cameras on. Yeah well it's good that you have two two witnesses or better than one so hopefully they you, you recorded on the your body cam as well. Oh yeah it's okay, on. Okay okay but by yeah, policy yeah. you can't just I was like why yeah, can't yeah. we just do it on the camera? Yeah policies are I guess they just set by whatever corporation wants to run things here. Okay you ready? Yep. Okay, this is Officer Matini, badge number 737, date is 9-24-22, time is 12-25. Statement is being taken from Sean Berry, who resides at 7444 Southeast 92nd Loop in Bellevue, Florida, 34420. His date of birth is 10-24-1965, phone number is 352 Eight five seven five one two one. Statements being conducted at Sullivan and Olympia. Gonna go to Police Department report number is two two zero three one seven six. Okay, would you raise your right hand? As a law enforcement officer in the state of Florida, I'm empowered to swear you in under oath for the purpose of taking a sworn statement pursuant to Florida State Statute one one seven point one zero. Do you, Sean Berry, solemnly swear or affirm that the statement and testimony you're about to give is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? So I hope you got it. I affirm. Okay, hand down, please. By having you raise your right hand and placing you under oath, you're sworn to tell me the truth and not withhold any information. If you lie or withhold any information, you'll be committing the offense of perjury. Perjury is a serious crime. Should I find that you have lied to me knowingly in this statement, you can be charged under Florida law for violating this perjury statute. You understand what I've just explained to you about perjury? Uh, yes, sir. Okay, go ahead and tell us what happened from your perspective, the confrontation between Lewis and that gentleman in a blue shirt. Okay, I was engaged in a protest on the public sidewalk, uh, First Amendment protest, uh, with Mr. Lewis and his mother. Uh, we were uh, standing, I were kind of, we were kind of talking a little bit with two of the police officers, uh, uh, Officer, what's your, what's Matini. your name? Matini. and the other officer? Corporal Trufan. Corporal Trufan. Okay, I'm real lousy at pronouncing words. I hate to butcher them. So. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, anyway, uh, I, I heard a commotion going on. Just uh, We were standing in the blocked off intersection of the uh, Pettigorda flea market. I heard a commotion, looked up, and there was a man doing what a lot of uh, people do when they get annoyed at people filming. They shove their cell phone in the other person's face. You know, as close as they can without making contact. They do it from multiple angles, thinking it's going to rouse somebody up. Because apparently they're just transferring. It rouses them up, so they think the cell phone is going to rouse the other person up. It's my opinion. But anyway, at one point, he lunged with a cell phone at uh, the uh, 
person's face. So you don't have to lean. Huh? Just open moving it, yeah, so you don't have yeah, to lean okay. into it. Yeah, sir. I got a bad back. <laughs> anyway, he lunged the phone into his face and then turned, looked like he turned to walk away and some words were exchanged and he returned immediately. And my attention was drawn away from when he turned to leave. My attention was drawn toward the two police officers to get their attention as to what just transpired, the uh, crime that I witnessed. And when I turned back around, the man was back again menacing uh, Mr. Lewis. Uh, he was right up on him. Uh, I'm not sure at that point whether he, I don't believe he made any physical contact with him, but it was definitely uh, a menacing act. Yeah, so. But anyway, that's, that's it. I got some of it on my phone, and my phone's a little here and there when I turn, my phone turns. So I've got some of it. I guess some of the officers have it on their body cam, they turn as well. So that's my statement, and uh, that's it. Okay. Uh, is there anything you want to add, change, or delete from what you just told me? No. All right. Is everything you told me in this statement the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? So I hope you got it. To the very best of my recollection. Okay, let's conclude the statement. It is 12-28. Date is 9-24-22. Okay. And we're clear. Okay. <laughs> See, like a director. Uh, yeah. Cut. Okay, that's all I need, sir. Okay. Um, Lewis has the uh, case number. Okay. Um, if I'm sure, I don't know who'll be doing the, I'm sure y'all are going to do an open record, you know, yeah, yeah, copy yeah, board, yeah. so. Um, that's not, that's, that's more of an exercise in the uh, process, you know, of, uh, we, we get our information that way to publish, but it's also an uh, exercise in the system, whether it works or not, you know. Oh, and yeah, uh, I'm just saying, yeah. I'm, I'm sure yeah, you, yeah. I knew you were going to. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so that's why exactly. I was telling you that he's got the case. Yeah, yeah. And, uh. A lot of times, you know, we get we get denied service. And I know I know if you the last time when the two gentlemen were arrested at the department down here. Before that happened, we were denied service. Um, oh, the, okay, yeah. Yeah, they Sorry. closed the window. Closed the window. Denied, denied a records request at that point. Uh, I stayed in the lobby, not filming. I, I came there by knowing, you know, the statute. I wasn't going to challenge the statute that day, but I was going to be an eyewitness. You can't trespass the eyes. But anyway, uh, when I went in there, I was helping Geo, uh, he speaks to the voice modulator, get his records request. We were denied records at that point, the window was closed. So I just sat down and grabbed a brochure and opened it. And at that point, I started becoming eyewitness to what transpired. And while I was looking at the brochure, the brochure was doing this right here the whole time because people were being, <laughs> I thought I was gonna be next. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, I got trespassed sitting in there. I was told by two officers he's not Office. filming, he's fine to be in. I'm good, thank you very much, sir. Yeah, I got told by two officers, a female officer and another detective, that I was fine to be there because I wasn't recorded. Even Lipker, uh, uh, um, not Lipker, but uh, uh, Jimenez said, you're fine, you're not recording, you're fine to be in here. I waited around like 45 minutes for records. Finally, uh, Jimenez came out with partial records. I tried to make records requests. Capped on the glass and tried to get the phone at some point. And because I capped on the glass, he decided to give me a, tr a trespass. Even though, know, you know, if you know if you walk up to somebody's front door, that's the invitation to the front door to knock on the front door and get the attention of people. The walkway, the front door, all that uh, is a public invitation to come up to my house, ring the doorbell, or knock on the door. Anybody, everybody, without a very, without, if there's not a different fit there, it's different. But anyway, I got a trespass. Yep. Okay, well, thank you. I'll get it all written up. Uh, I gave Jerry a chance to announce the violence. Yeah, okay. So can you do me a favor? He's, he's, he's hard to say. I know you can't promise me, and I know you can't. I'll let the sounds get like this right here because they're more rigid. They stand up a little better. Oh, back out here! For no, no way. Some people are a little more emot emotive than others at their at their expressions. Don't start. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sorry for yelling. And yelling and y'all trying to do your thing. Okay. I just literally wrote the sheriff in Charlotte County. Along
None yeah. whatsoever. I'll, I will always I, give credit where it's due. I will always give a gold star and credit okay. where it is due. One hundred and ten percent. All of that about giving but credit accept, where it's deserved, and of oh, course the accountability where it's needed. Officers that will run into a film to save children. Never done it before. They'll run in there, there to save the children. I'm good. I, I'll pray for them every night. Okay. Yeah. 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 One way or another. Yeah. 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 I pray for those officers that, that do their job, put their life on the line. And that happens every single day. And some officers, some officers, you know, the ones will do it. And some of them won't. Doesn't mean I don't have a voice. Have you ever written a citation for a shirt like mine? It's just gonna stay right Yeah, Punta Gorda is trying to kill free speech. It's, it's They're finding it's a hundred dollars for words. Yeah, I, I ate a sandwich here when I stopped at that Circle K before I got here. But you want your drink over there? Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I grabbed it there. <laughs> Hope the lid's still secure on it. 